ਇਟਸ ਗੈਟਿੰਗ ਡੀਪਰ ਐਂਡ ਡੀਪਰ ਇਸ ਦੇ ਨਾਲ ਅਸੀਂ ਕਿਹੜੇ ਸਟੈਪਸ ਲੈ ਸਕਨੇ ਆ ਕਿਹੜੇ ਮੈਜਰਸ ਲੈ ਸਕਨੇ ਆ ਕਿ ਅਸੀਂ ਆਪਣੇ ਬੱਚਿਆਂ ਨੂੰ ਹੈਲਪ ਕਰ ਸਕੀਏ ਉਸ ਦੇ ਨਾਲ ਹੀ ਮੈਂ ਤੁਹਾਨੂੰ ਇਂਟਰੋਡਿਊਸ ਕਰ ਰਹੀ ਆ ਆਫ ਕੋਰਸ ਸਾਰੇ ਗੈਸਟ ਜਿਹੜੇ ਸਾਡੇ ਨਾਲ ਨੇ ਕਮਿਸ਼ਨਰ ਫਲਾਨਿਕਲ ਫਲਾਨਿਗਨ ਐਂਡ ਡਾਕਟਰ ਰੈਨਲਸ ਫॉर ਐਜੂਕੇਟਿੰਗ ਅਸ ਕਿ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਕਿਸ ਤਰ੍ਹਾਂ ਦੱਸ ਸਕਦੇ ਹੋ ਕਿ ਤੁਹਾਡੇ ਬੱਚੇ ਡਰੱਗਸ ਲੈ ਰਹੇ ਨੇ ਔਰ ਕਿਸ ਤਰ੍ਹਾਂ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਨੂੰ ਬਚਾ ਸਕਦੇ ਹੋ ਐਂਡ ਵਾਟ ਆਰ ਦ ਮੈਜਰਸ ਯੂ ਹੈਵ ਟੂ ਟੇਕ ਨਾਓ ਕਮਿਸ਼ਨਰ ਟੈਲ ਅਸ what are some of the extremes that you see that these kids are going to to get their hands on these drugs well we we see groups of people young adults okay. um traveling from long island into new york city exposing themselves to the danger of a drug market um you know you're buying a product that you're really not sure what that is there this is not regulated um you know i'm buying a a deck of heroin a bunch of bags of heroin mm -hmm. I really don't know what's in there. I don't know what I'm ingesting in my body. However, what we've seen is that heroin has increased in purity from its historical uh norms. You know, back in the 1970s, heroin was not a very pure and I'm by, by pure I mean chemically pure. It, okay. it was adulterated. There were a lot of other substances mixed with heroin. We're starting to see heroin that's about 95% or better pure, which leads to um other ways to take heroin you know typically we think about people that use heroin as injecting themselves mm -hmm. with a with a needle that's not the way that we see heroin use uh pretty much on long island although there is a component of IV, iv drug abuse we see because it is so pure people have the ability to snort it it seems relatively innocuous although it 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 uh very rapidly leads to um some some other issues including eventually iv drug usage so the face of heroin is different from what what we what it used to historically be. think about you know um this heroin problem transcends demographics mm -hmm. it transcends ethnicities race and religion we've seen people of all ages from as probably under 16 years old to over 60 years old wow. that have come into the criminal justice system uh you know in some fashion related to heroin so it's a very very widespread and and um you know little different from it, you, the way it used to be issue well when you say you're seeing ages 16 to 60 mm -hmm. by the time you're seeing this person who's 16 having this addiction to the point that it's coming to your department's hands that means that child has already been taking drugs maybe for a year maybe for two years and 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 Dr. Reynolds can speak to this better than I can but you know this also starts with some other associated um abuse of other things marijuana alcohol prescription medication uh these are all gateways that we know empirically lead to things like heroin abuse okay yeah. so then I'm going to come to you Dr. Reynolds and have you tell us when you're seeing these kids by the time they're coming to you if they're at that age from yeah. 16 onwards you're not getting these kids you know to you for treatment right. it just it didn't just happen that's yesterday right. that's exactly for right for it to come to that point that it's coming yeah. to you it's been around yes. for a year two years at least two years typically and it 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 very often begins with the use of alcohol um progresses to marijuana progresses to the prescription medications we just talked about and then heroin is is the last step and very often parents will say i know my kid drinks on the weekends and maybe they've tried pot but thank god it's not heroin and for those parents i say well it can be mm -hmm. um we have to if we're going to really address this heroin epidemic we have to address alcohol and other drugs because kids don't just start shooting heroin having never consumed alcohol before having never used other drugs there's a progression of addiction mm -hmm. and unless something interrupts that progression it gets worse and worse and worse and and by the time we see folks they're 2 to 3 years down the line wow. which means that it takes some time to address those things and and keep in mind when we're talking about adolescence there's a whole bunch of stuff going on in adolescence i mean there's a reason our kids are taking oxycontin and vicodin those exactly. drugs are used for pain for a lot of kids adolescence is a very confusing painful time oh. um and so you take the regular issues of adolescence and you mix them up with addiction and it's it's a fairly hard road for kids that that progress down that road the good news in all of this there is there is good news okay. drug and alcohol abuse is 100% preventable okay right? addiction isn't curable it's treatable but drug and alcohol abuse which sets the stage for addiction is preventable 
that means rolling up our sleeves a little bit earlier and having some tough conversations. And, and taking a look at some things that, that you know, as law enforcement entities, we've never done before. You know, we, we've reached out to Dr. Reynolds and his organization because we recognized that we needed um, some, some more tools in our arsenal mm -hmm. to, to deal with this. Now, of course, we do our historic enforcement efforts. We arrest people. We look for drug trafficking organizations. Um, we find places where drugs are sold. We, we conduct investigations and we arrest people. But we've also taken a, a look and we've recognized that prevention and education are very, very effective when, when appropriately used. So we've expended you know, significant amounts of asset forfeiture funds. These mm -hmm. are funds that are really taking the profit out of drug dealers and other criminals' uh, pockets, mm -hmm. and we've invested that into a couple of different programs um, in partnership with, with Jeff and, and LICAD. Uh, one is a parental awareness campaign, mm -hmm. and the other is an educational campaign that, that really deals with kindergarten through 12th grade. It's called Too Good for Drugs. It's an evidence-based program. Um, you know, really law enforcement typically deals with the uh, supply side, not the demand side. Exactly. We recognize that we need a multifaceted approach to get a handle on this, on this problem. Okay. That's a lot of information for me to translate. <laughs> 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 well, um, just now Dr. Reynolds ne kya si ka pehla ki kaafi bachche ne je tanu inna nu je treatment vaste inna de kol aande ne oh bachche usually 16 saal di age to leke 60 saal de budhiyan tak hunde ne so now think about it jab tak bachcha inna de kol aa reha hai 16 saal da oh habit itni buri ho chuki hai ki usnu hun doctor kol le ja ke treat karwana hai a treatment overnight shuru nahi hui a habit overnight nahi shuru hui इस स्टेज तक आन वास्ते वो बच्चा हो सकता है साल दो साल पहला ही ड्रग्स ले रहे ने दैट मींस कि वो बच्चा 14 साल दा या 13 साल दा हैगा हु स्टार्टेड टू टेक ड्रग्स एट दैट एज इफ इट्स अ 13 14 ईयर ओल्ड 15 ईयर ओल्ड तुसी ओ कन्वर्सेशन बच्चा नाल कदों शुरू करोगे कि तुसी उना नाल गल करो कि ड्रग्स किस तरह उना नो हार्मफुल ने एंड हाउ दे कैन अवॉइड इट बट एट द सेम टाइम बच्चे सीधा हेरोइन एडिक्शन ते नहीं पहुंचते heroin addiction tak pahunchan waste oh dooje drugs pehle try kar dene and believe it or not alcohol is a drug oh bhi ek kisam di drug hai jo alcohol to shuru kar dene ghar te choti moti jehdi dawaiyan ne oh shuru kar dene marijuana shuru kar dene e choti choti cheezan to leke they reach up to bigger things so please agar tanu lagda hai ki tade bacche weekend te ek drink le le thi friends naal even if they're 15 what is it agar tade bachcha ਤੁਹਾਡੇ ਸਾਹਮਣੇ ਤੁਹਾਨੂੰ ਪਤਾ ਹੈ ਪੀ ਰਿਹਾ ਔਰ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਉਹ ਕਨਵਰਸੇਸ਼ਨ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਨਾਲ ਨਹੀਂ ਕੀਤੀ ਵਾਟ ਇਜ਼ ਦੀ ਐਗਜ਼ਾਮਪਲ ਦੈਟ ਯੂ ਆਰ ਸੈਟਿੰਗ देयर ਫॉर देम ਸੋ ਪਲੀਜ਼ ਇਸ ਤੋਂ ਯੂ ਨੋ ਬਿਫੋਰ ਐਨੀਥਿੰਗ ਐਟ ਆਲ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਆਪਣੇ ਬੱਚਿਆਂ ਨਾਲ ਗੱਲ ਕਰੋ ਤਾਂ ਕਿ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਨੂੰ ਪਤਾ ਹੋਏ ਯੈਸ ਇਟਸ ਨਾਟ ਅ ਗੁੱਡ ਕਨਵਰਸੇਸ਼ਨ ਦੈਟ ਯੂ ਵਾਂਟ ਟੂ ਹੈਵ ਬਟ ਇਟਸ ਅ ਕਨਵਰਸੇਸ਼ਨ ਯੂ ਮਸਟ ਹੈਵ ਐਟ ਦ ਸੇਮ ਟਾਈਮ ਪੁਲਿਸ ਡਿਪਾਰਟਮੈਂਟ ਇਜ਼ ਸਪੈਂਡਿੰਗ ਅ ਲੋਟ ਆਫ ਮਨੀ ਕਿ ਉਹ ਇਸ ਇਸ਼ੂ ਨੂੰ ਪ੍ਰੀਵੈਂਟ ਕਰਨ ਐਟ ਦ ਸੇਮ ਟਾਈਮ ਐਜੂਕੇਟ ਕਰਨ ਇਹ ਲੋਕ ਆਪਣਾ ਪੈਸਾ ਲਗਾ ਕੇ ਦੇ ਆਰ ਆਫ ਕੋਰਸ ਡੂਇੰਗ ਸੈਮੀਨਾਰਸ ਜਿਹੜੇ ਕਿੰਡਰਗਾਰਡਨ ਦੇ ਬੱਚਿਆਂ ਤੋਂ ਲੈ ਕੇ 12 ਸਕੂਲ 12 ਗ੍ਰੇਡ ਦੇ ਬੱਚਿਆਂ ਤੱਕ ਆਫ ਕੋਰਸ ਉਹ ਕਿੰਡਰਗਾਰਡਨ ਔਰ ਇੱਕ ਸਾਲ ਫਰਸਟ ਗ੍ਰੇਡ ਦੇ ਬੱਚਿਆਂ ਨਾਲ ਡਰਗਸ ਦੀ ਗੱਲ ਤੇ ਨਹੀਂ ਕਰਨਗੇ ਪਰ ਐਟ ਦ ਸੇਮ ਟਾਈਮ ਧੀਰੇ-ਧੀਰੇ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਨੂੰ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਹੋ ਸਕੇ ਦੇਅਰ ਸੋ ਮਚ ਐਕਸਪੋਜ਼ਰ ਆਟ ਦੇ ਧੀਰੇ-ਧੀਰੇ ਇਨ ਅ ਡਿਫਰੈਂਟ ਵੇ ਦੇ ਇੰਟਰੋਡਿਊਸ ਡਿਫਰੈਂਟ ਥਿੰਗਸ ਟੂ ਥਮ ਐਂਡ ਟੇਕ ਇਟ ਆਫ ਕੋਰਸ ਟੂ ਦਾ ਹਾਈਅਰ ਲੈਵਲ ਵ